Blue Eddie has stepped up the game once more. Check this out. This is the new AC 180 P. P for pretty darn powerful. This is a step up from the original 180, but the 180P, it is packed with a bunch of power. Now, before we start the video, we want to thank Blue Eddie for sending us this AC 180P for testing and review. And we are going to take this out next week and do some real life camping testing. So this right here is introducing Blue Eddie's AC 180P solar portable power station. This powerhouse is not just portable energy solution. It's a statement of style and innovation. If you look at it, this is not your standard Blue Eddie colors. Uh, Blue Eddie usually use blue or gray in all their power stations, but this time you are looking at one with some orange accents. This thing equipped with advanced solar capabilities, the AC 180P ensures reliable power source for every adventure, whether you're using it when you're boondocking, camping, or off-grid situation, or during a power outage at home. This thing is a beast. Now the brief overview of this power station, it is a 1800 watt power station with a 2700 power lifting mode. And I will talk about that in just a little bit. So the capacity of this thing is 1440 watt hours. Now the Blue 80 AC 180, the, the one before this, had about 1140 somewhat uh, watt hours. But this one, same size, same weight, they pushed it to 1440 watt hours, which is amazing. If you look at the front, it has 11 output ports for multiple devices, and there are four flexible recharging ways you can recharge this. One, to regular AC outlet in your home. Two, solar power panels. Three, a 12 volt car charger. Or four, a, a regular gas generator. Now this has the smart control and monitor uh, with the Blue Eddy app. So you can control everything from your cell phone. And it charges from zero to 80% using an AC power cord only in 45 minutes. I mean, that's just amazing, 45 minutes. And most of all, it's eco-friendly, it's quiet, and it's cost-effective. Now, the AC 180P is compact and portable. This thing only weighs 37 pounds and has two convenient carrying handles, which are protected with a rubber grip. Um, so if your hands are wet or sweaty, uh, there's no slippage and it makes it easy to carry around to your next adventure. The AC 180P also has a continuous power source. This power station boasts 1800 watts of power and supports the power lifting mode where you can use the Blue Eddy app and boost this power station to 2700 watts to power on your big uh, equipment or your big appliances. When you purchase your Blue Eddy AC 180P, you're gonna get a user manual. You're gonna get several cords, but one of the cords in there is gonna be an AC cord. And this cord right here, if you plug it into shore power or grid power, uh, you go from zero to 80% uh, in about 45 minutes. The cool thing is there is no big brick anymore. Blue Eddy uh, stopped making or stopped using those bricks um, that became a pain to transport, pain to keep with you. Right now, all it is is a power cord. Also get your solar power charging cord um, for your solar power panels. And this thing, like I said, accepts up to 500 watts of power. Thirdly, you get your 12 volt cigarette lighter uh, car charger. So if you want to charge this 
in your car while you're driving around, you have the ability to do so. But just remember, uh, it'll be a little longer to charge up versus using the grid power. Then lastly, another way you can charge it is use a gas generator using the AC cord. So let's check out the front of the 180P. Now, when you look at it, the big difference, if, you're, if you are a Blue Eddy fan or know a lot about Blue Eddy, first thing you're gonna notice is this orange accents. Um, when I saw it, I had to do a double take because I was like, man, that is, that is amazing. I mean, it was just, when I saw it, I was like, I need to get one of those. Um, not because of the orange accents, but what this thing has. And, you know, I like when Blue Eddy changes or a company changes things up, um, but it makes this unit stand out. Now, I don't know if they're gonna change all of their colors of their power stations to orange, or they just did it for the 180p, but you'll be able to know because this thing stands out. Now on the front of the unit, there are 11 input or output ports. And we'll start here on the left. Right here is your 12 volt cigarette lighter. Uh, this is a 10 amp cigarette lighter. I hope in the future that Blue Eddy changes this 10 amp to 15 amp. I would love to see a 15 amp cigarette uh, 12 volt plug because a lot of us use diesel heaters and diesel heaters uh, take a lot of uh, amps uh, to start those glow plugs. And if you use a 10 amp on a diesel heater, it'll either kick the diesel heater off or it won't start. But there are other ways you can start your diesel heaters um, and then using your power station. And maybe we'll cover that later on, but Blue Eddy, if you're listening, uh, I like to see this in a 15 amp. Uh, right above it is your solar power uh, inputs. And like I said, you can power up this unit or charge it up to 500 watts of solar power panel. Um, the front of it, you have three buttons. You have your DC, your power, and AC. So let's go ahead and power it on. And right off the bat, you're gonna notice the typical Blue Eddy screen. It's a really crisp and clear LCD screen. Uh, right now I'm showing 77% and I've got my input side and output side. Uh, when I hit the button for DC, you will see that DC uh, icon come on. And then when I hit AC, it's right next to it. Uh, that will also come on. Uh, right below it, you have five USB uh, ports here, and you have a USB-C, which is 100 watts. Then you have two USB-As, and then, uh, of course, on this side, you have additional two USB-As. On the end here, you have four AC output plugs, and this is hooked up um, to a pure sine inverter. So um, you're getting crisp, clean power to protect your equipment such as cell phone, laptops, and other important uh, devices. Now on the top, you will see this has a wireless charger and that is a 15 watt wireless charger. So all you have to do is drop your cell phone on the top and it will start charging. Uh, my AC60 does have a wireless charger also on the top. Here on the side, you have your, pow your AC power input where you plug in your cord, you have a circuit breaker, and then you have a uh, grounding uh, uh, terminal that you can hook up there. Now, this does not have a light in the back of it like the other units have. The AC60 and the EB3A uh, all have a LED light on there. This does not have one, but that's not, that doesn't, uh, that's not real big important to me because uh, I don't really use the lights on the other one, but if I had to, they're available. I usually use a flashlight or a headlamp. Now, what really impresses me about Blue Eddy is their Blue Eddy smart app. And you can download the app from the Apple Store. 
and that allows you to use your cell phone as a remote control to monitor, to power on, to power off, to change the charging modes on your power stations. So if on your cell phone, once you download the Blue Eddy app, you go ahead and open up the app. And right now it's showing my devices. These are the devices I have on my smartphone. Uh, let's go ahead and open up the AC180P. And it says not found because I do not have the power on. Uh, so we'll go ahead and hit the power. Uh, once it comes on, you go ahead and hit and then now it's searching. So right now it's telling me it's got 77% with no input or outputs and that matches up with this. Now, once I plug something in here, um, you will see the draw or the power coming in to the unit. Um, you can also turn on and off your, your AC and DC using your phone. So let's go ahead and pop, turn that on and you can see your the DC, uh, just went on you can do that also with your ac and the ac just went on and of course you can shut it down uh, just the opposite way and it'll turn it off you can also shut the unit down completely uh, just by hitting the off button it said it's powering down in nine seconds go hit that and now the unit is off the great thing about this app is you can change the power modes for charging, either turbo, eco, or standard charging mode. And like I said, I've got all my other units on here. The cool thing is if I have this in my camper or in the bottom of the van, I don't have to go out to see what or how much power I got left on the unit. I could just bring up the app. So if you get the Blue Eddy or any of the Blue Eddy products, um, be sure to use or upload the app to your smartphone because it's like a remote control for your, your power stations. So next week when we go camping, I am gonna plug in my 12 volt refrigerator, my all my batteries for my drone, my cell phone, as well as my coffee uh, maker. And I, I'll tell you, coffee makers draw a lot of wattage, uh, regardless of the size. Now, many of you have seen my Juul coffee uh, cooker. Uh, that draw, that little cooker draws 500 watts. So. My other power stations have a difficult time when it starts to power on because it'll jump um, that close to its maximum capacity. Now a microwave oven, um, I have to use something this big to power on a microwave oven and I'll show you that in a little bit. But uh, I'm also going to power up my Keurig machine and I will show you because a curry coffee machine uh, draws a lot of power as well. But the, I have no doubt that this thing will handle it. Okay, this right here is my curry coffee maker. And this thing draws, I wanna say about 800 watts, I believe. It's been a while since I plugged it into a power station, but let's just go ahead and see if this Blue 80 AC 180P can power it up. And let's see how much you can hear the coffee maker kicking in. And that output should kick up here in a little bit. Right now, it's warming up. 1400 watts from a curry coffee maker. That's amazing, something this would draw that much watts, but I would probably have a smaller one. This is a multi-cup, so I would probably have a, a one or two single cup, uh, or even a, 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 a hot water pot. But I just wanted to show you for testing purposes that this thing can handle a Keurig. 
the screen will go off after a certain amount of time. You can also program that. So it didn't kick it off. It just, screen just went into a save, save mode. And there you go, folks. We're making a cup of coffee with the Blue Eddy AC 180P. 1400 watts of power draw, no problem. So the warranty on the AC 180P is five years. Five years, that's pretty decent for a power station of this size. The life expectancy of the unit is 10 years. So 10 years life expectancy, with a five year warranty from Blue Eddy. Now this power station has 3,500 life cycles, meaning you can discharge and power uh, this thing for 3,500 cycles. So that's pretty amazing. Now this unit itself also has what they call pass through power. So if you're charging it, you can actually plug in your inputs, uh, to your devices or your equipment and power it on while it is charging. So that's another cool feature of this unit. Now, like I mentioned, um, I haven't seen this on the Blue Eddy website, but if you go to blueeddypower.com and just check it within the next week or so, um, they may have this available for Christmas, but um, right now I don't know the price of the unit I want to say it's going to be between a thousand and twelve hundred. I may be wrong. They may have a sale on it, but um, it'll be out soon. And when it hits the market, uh, this thing will fly off the shelves because it is a good mid range power station. And like I said, it's perfect for boondocking, camping, um, off grid power or even doing a power uh, outage. So, so far, I think the Blue Eddy AC-180P is living up to its name, both aesthetically and functionality. This thing is gonna be one of my favorite power stations. I can't wait to take it out with us next week. So I hope you enjoyed this overview of the AC-180P by Blue Eddy. Um, this thing, I mean, I am going to have a great time and this is going to be my go-to, I think, in my camper uh, build-out. But I can't wait till next weekend. We're going to use this thing out there and put it through some real heavy testing. But this was just an overview to show you what is coming out by Blue Eddy. Like I said, go to BlueEddyPower.com. Again, thank you Blue Eddy for sending us this unit for testing and review. And until our next video. We'll see you then. This is Separate Gumby out.